Hi, uh, my name is Yuji Naka. Uh, you are watching the uh, Platform 32. Oh my god. Let's listen to that again. Uh, my name is Yuji Naka. Uh, you are watching the uh, Platform 32. Oh yeah. Sorry about that blatant bit of self-promotion, but it's not often you meet a true gaming legend and get them to say the name of your show, and when it comes to gaming gods, Yuji Naka is right up there with the big names like Shigeru Miyamoto and John Romero. For those of you thinking, Yuji Hooji, if I was to mention a certain blue hedgehog, you may get an idea of just how immense this man is. Because Mr. Naka is the creator of Sega's most famous mascot and one of their longest running characters. That's right, he's Sonic the Hedgehog's daddy, and in October 2010, he came to the UK to discuss his amazing career and talk about his newest game, Ivy the Kiwi, at the Eurogamer Expo in London. Platform 32 pushed some old people off their seats to bag a front row position for his on-stage question and answer session, and with the help of a Japanese to English dictionary, we are proud to bring you the best bits of Yuji Naka at Eurogamer Expo. Expo 2010. So the big question I suppose, and the one that all budding games designers and developers want to know is, how did Yuji become a developer and land such a sweet job at Sega? あの、ま、それでWorking his way through the Sega ranks must have meant that Yuji has had his finger in quite a few gaming pies. Hope he washed his fingers first. What games did he work on before Sonic? Original title, みたいなもの行くと、まあソニー、ファンタシースターの1とか2とか、えー、なんですかね。まああと異色物でアウトランとかスペースハリアとかグルズンゴーストとか。Surprisingly, Girls Garden isn't another name for Lady Garden. It was, in fact, a game for the Sega SG-1000, which was the first Sega console to be released, even before the Master System. It definitely doesn't sound like a classic game, but it was received quite well, and without it, Sonic would probably never have existed. So, where did the concept for Sonic come from? So, this is a ま、すごくよく聞かれる質問なんですけど、あの、ソニックっていうのはあの、ま、僕があのプログラマーだったので、あの、滑らかなこう、フィールドをこうずっとこう駆け抜けるみたいなプログラムを作ってたんですね。で
スマッシュブラザーズなんかは僕が直接、えー、ソニックを入れてくれっていうことで、えー、お願いに行ったりとかしてるので僕にとっては、まあ、夢の共演が実現できたので、まあ、皆さんにも楽しんでもらえてて。いいんじゃないかなと思いますけども。Ivy the Kiwi is Yuji's newest game from his own development studio Probe. Can you tell us the word about the bird, please, Yuji? あのー、まあこの Ivy the Kiwi っていうのはですね、まあ絵本を舞台にした、えー、ゲームを作りました。で、あのー、まあ生まれた時にまあお母さんがいなくてですね、あのー、どこ行ったんだろうっていうこうまああのキウイの赤ちゃんがいるんですけども。まあ、そのキュウイナカちゃん自体はですね小さな段差すら登れないのでそれをまあプレイヤー自身が神様となってですねその絵本の中にこうツタをこう描き入れていくことによってゴールまで導いてあげてお母さんのところへ連れてってあげるっていうのがこのゲームです。So one of the things I found difficult was working out how to pronounce Ivy the Kiwi as it has this weird question mark at the end of the title Ivy the Kiwi? Ivy the Kiwi? Ivy the Kiwi? Yeah. What's it all mean, yo? やはり、まあ、そのようにこうなんでついてるんだろうってまず思ってもらいたかったからっていうのが一つなんですけども、あのーまあ、通常このゲームを、まあ、クリプレイされるとですね皆さん大体最後にエンディングに、まあ、スタッフロールだとか,、あのー、なんですかムービーとかいろんなものがまあ見れるかと思うんですけども、まあ、今回のゲームでは最後のご褒美に絵本を、あのーまあ、見たいと絵本を読ませたいと皆さんに思ったんですね。なのでそこで絵本の中でそういったこうアイビザキュイなのっていうところが最後がわかるようにっていうことで、えー、まあ今回クエスチョンマークをつけましたので最後まで解いていただくとその謎がわかるようになっています。Oh you cheeky monkey Yuji! Finally, considering Yuji Naka has inspired countless games developers around the globe, which developer does he believe to be the most inspirational in the gaming world? そうですね。まあやっぱり。あのー、宮本茂さんが作られたやっぱりスーパーマリオブラザーズがやっぱりすごく僕にとっても影響を与えていると思いますし、まあ、ゲーム業界全部に影響を与えていて僕は素晴らしくいいんじゃないかなと思っていますが。はい Hearing from such a legendary developer as Naka san was a dream come true for me and all the other attendees at the Eurogamer Expo who managed to bundle into the crowded conference hall. Although none of the lineup has been released for the next Eurogamer Expo, you can bet it will be just as good as 2010s, if not better. And I can't wait to see what big names pop up for us to talk to in 2011. If you want to come face to face with gaming legends, play the biggest unreleased games, or even bump into me, then you will be pleased to know that 2011's Eurogamer Expo is scheduled to take place at London's Earl's Court from the 22nd to the 25th of September. And you can find out more by visiting the Eurogamer website at www.eurogamer.net. See you there! After his QA session, the man who entertained many generations of gamers was more than happy to sign these two framed Eurogamer brochures for me to give away to you, my P32 viewing friends. Frames not included. Actually, I think you'll find the frames are included. Oh, oh. frames included. That's better. Anyway, let's not forget the most important point. These brochures were signed by the man who made Sonic. They were touched by the hands that developed one of the greatest games ever. Ever! And you can win one! Now, to be in with a chance to win this most awesome of awesome prizes, all you need to do is answer the following question Which game developer has inspired Yuji Naka more than anyone else? Know the answer? Well, you should do because it's somewhere in this video. So you better have been paying attention, young man. Or girl. Once you have it, all you need to do is email your answer to p32comp at hotmail.co.uk by Wednesday, the 26th of January, to be in with a chance of winning. Both winners will be announced on Thursday, the 27th of January, on the Platform 32 Facebook page. Good luck. Mm -hmm. 